which, by the way, we are on fire watch tomorrow. Let's get to Chief Meteorologist Scott Paget, who's got more information on this. And we don't have a, a fire watch issued, but we're watching out for the possibility of some fires that will be developing in the next few days. That's going to be the story as temperatures warm up. Tomorrow, still that northwest wind holding on, but then Saturday and Sunday, we see our winds increasing, remaining out of the south, and our temperatures warm into the mid 80s. So if you plan your weekend now, just keep that in mind. And we do need some rain. We have rain over the next six days, but it's not until Tuesday night and then into Wednesday. Wednesday, we have more widespread rain all the way. So let's plan for our, your midweek next week. 83 degrees, the temperature on Tuesday. So that warming wind continues. The cold front moves in. And as that's moving in, we will see some scattered showers late on Tuesday and then into the early morning hours on Wednesday. There's the potential, maybe some strong to borderline severe storms through the day Wednesday. We'll give you some more details on that as we get a little bit more close towards uh, the midweek next week, but I can tell you with pretty good confidence the rain will move through. Temperatures will drop behind that into the mid 70s. So how much rain are we going to be seeing? Possibly a half of an inch of rain to maybe eight tenths of an inch of rain if we're lucky in some localized spots. We'll take any we can get because of this. We have extreme drought through a lot of North Texas to any moderate drought to then that extreme drought showing up. So with that in mind, there are a number of outdoor burn bans continuing. Cook County, Tarrant, Ellis, Navarro and to the west. So very dry vegetation that's out there really could use a whole lot of rain and, and we do have some on the way. So just keep that in mind as these winds will get breezy again over the next few days. Right now they're calm. We're at 54 degrees under clear skies and it's going to be seeing uh, t tomorrow morning. T you're going to be seeing temperatures down into the upper 30s to the low 40s. I almost didn't want to say it. Uh, we have temperatures that are going to be cold enough for tomorrow morning for that light jacking again. But then into the afternoon hours, pretty nice. Our temperatures back up to near the 80 degree mark with our winds out of the south southeast. The flip side is the pollen count, unfortunately, also in the high category of maple, oak and hackberry. The major allergens remains in the high category the next five days. So the seven day forecast, you saw that sneak peek of the weekend into the mid 80s Sunday, Monday 86, 83 Tuesday. Then the rain moves through in the cooler air by Thursday. We'll see 69 degrees after we start out at 48. Ken. All right, Scott, thank you very much. Still